Oh yeah, stress. What up, G? Yo. What's up? I feel bad. How'd your game go? Not good. I think you could have won the priest one. Mage versus priest. Because I might do the same guys. So much can happen in your mage deck. Yeah, the, 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 the point of the deck is that uh, yeah, like get the missiles and then you fire the missiles with the Malagos and then you, they die. Those were all the last couple cards. Of the yeah, it was like the last three cards. And I yeah, didn't, I didn't quite get there. It sucks you didn't have Emperor when you had duplicate. That's, duping the Emperor. Yeah, yeah, yeah so duping far. the duping the Conjurer is not so useful in that deck. It's kind of but it's, it was it's like, really slow. I, I was hoping that uh, like. The scientist didn't give me to do, but then it kind of forced me to play like that. Yeah, if that was Ace Bear, I could have just chilled out for like a bunch of turns. True, and then yeah. duped the Emperor, but it got mind controlled anyway, so that would have worked. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, mind control is a good card. The wild. Oh, but you know, how do you draw? How do you what the hell? He drew his one of one. Gross. OP, OP. <laughs> how do you draw on the Emperor? Like, you know, before mind control turn though, then you'd be like, oh, oh yeah, you'd be on. Yeah, that would have worked. You just drew the Emperor on six. Bam. Emperor. Kill. The killer. Emperor. Kill it. What? Emperor Nova. What is this hand? Look at that. Actually, this is actually kind of fair, because, like, Dog is playing, like... A real... It, 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 he's got Wild Grip, but, like... It, oh, no, wait, Dog... It, no, yeah, Stripe no, Stripe, Stripe's actually just straight up playing Reno Lock, uh, which is, uh... A realist. Yeah, absolutely. And, um, you know, actually, Stripe Grip is probably going to win, because he has a Hellfire already in hand, and it kills almost everything. <laughs> Yeah, he drew ten. Dog might actually go like Darnassus use here, and then he's gonna get Hellfired. Yep. But then he has a five six against nothing. That's not so bad. Five uh, six against nothing is not so bad. Yeah, it's like a two for one, but like all right, you you get you get so much. So okay, he drew the Twilight Drake, which you might consider because Keepers only can be a one of. Yeah, it's it's a four eight, and it's. Rarely silence, but then, usually he'll still help her. though, I'd say. Yeah, it's a really good help her. It's a two for one, and you're pretty happy. But like, I wonder. It's it, it, they, you just straight up lose the game if you Twilight Drake and they have their one up keeper because he's he, always, he went with it. He's yeah, on I, like the six man. Uh, I guess I kind of like it. Yeah. Sorry. Okay, so comes out instantly. <laughs> so uh, before he even saw the draw, oh, he could he could draw a combo next turn and just kill him. Nah, <laughs> fun and interactive. I could think that. I mean, he's just gonna get Oh hellfire. my god! Okay, yeah, that's a... I think he assumed there's no Hellfire after that Drake came out. And now he's gonna be like, BAM! I'm Strive Crow. I oh, didn't tell you. At least the Drake dies in the Hellfire. Oh! oh. Do you do that? It seems fun, but I think it's worse. You're never gonna be able to play that MT deck for value again, right? Yeah, but the only way... I mean, how are you gonna lose to this Druid with one card if you just Hellfire? Uh, he, he plays Ancient Allure on 7. <laughs> I guess, uh... Oh, oh that, that's play. actually the worst one because yeah, he's, he's going back, uh, going back a mana. But he's got some other four four drops, so it doesn't really matter. Yeah. Uh, I guess. You, Are you surprised he didn't help out of the one? Yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. really surprised. But it killed his Twilight Drake too. Uh, it's like Perino. It's like uh, it's not great. It's not that I think he has a bush face, right? That's pretty much the only option. <laughs> Just two cards or Force of Nature and Swipe. Uh, the, the Force of Nature doesn't do anything because you can't squeeze in the hero power yet. I, um... I'd say the Druid already lost most of the time. Yeah. I mean, there's, there's an Argus ready there. Even if you take away his mana crystal, you can still play Argus. Or he takes, takes it away. Okay, I see. That's, oh, that's, maybe, maybe he's going to play it slow. Maybe he's going to play it slow. And draw Ancient Allure. It, so you swipe and then you go face, right? You're going face for sure here, right? Hero power of the Drake. Yeah, you, you go for this. No. What are you doing defending that 1-1? One, one? I mean, if he hits a 1-1, one, one, you, you most likely have mana to hero power next turn. Yeah. And for sure... Does so, Stripe help our now? I feel, I, it, like, the Hellfire is like way worse now, right? But Yeah, but he's not... It's still, it's still good enough. It sucks he lost a mana crystal. But, I mean, unless the Druid draws a really important card here, like, like Ancient Lore, then he's probably gonna lose. Oh! <laughs> Nobody gets BGH. It, it, it gets checked, but he could just draw combo. He, he's going to nine mana. He's at yeah. He's at thirteen. That, this would be this one of one of seven, right? Though I this would uh, sum up ladder one on one here. I guess you dab, right? There's one card in hand. You're not respecting combo. Yeah. I've got the beast in my. Sucks he lost that mana crystal. <laughs> yeah. But next turn he can Argus. Okay, no. Oh, that's actually good though. Yeah. <laughs> Oh. Nice top decks coming out. He doesn't have lethal through the sludge belcher anymore though, right? No. Yeah, that's gonna be a problem. Takes two trees and hero power to kill the first one. Only one tree is in phase. I mean, yeah. Maybe tap shredders. 
Yeah, okay. How much disrespect do you have for the Okay, problem? let's see if we top deck Savage Roar. Oh! Uh. Do you charge? I mean, I guess he's used Hellfire. You can charge here, power it, kill the slime with your. And the Mortal Kombat is a one of, right? I, I feel like you gotta take huge risks to be in this. Yeah, I like okay. this. Yeah, but now the Mortal Kombat is gonna come out. And. Bird then, I guess? But even so with. Scared. Even with more. Uh, it's like Coil Reno. Or Coil Heal. Coil Bot. Reno would be insane. No, Heal Bot doesn't work, right? Because then you're at 8. Dude, 3 out of 18 and combo does 18. Exactly 18. Yeah. Oh, Reno! No! Oh my god. Boy. And that'll be it. And there's gonna be Concede on the other side, <laughs> maybe? That's a tournament, maybe not. Let's see. Okay. Let's check his draw. Okay, that can still be Ancient Allure. Or like, Doctor Boom. Maybe Rag. Oh! Can't play that. It's such a good... Oh no, it's, it won't be good because Doctor Boom's already gonna be on the board. Alright. Oh man. So... Poor dog. Poor dog. Doc's still smiling though, he had a good time last night. He's in Vegas. You know? Yeah, it's my consolation prize of, like... Only being ahead of Nathan, or admirable. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> not even gonna risk the. the not even gonna risk uh, playing around big game hunter. I think the play here might actually be Snarius Pump. Go for Doom Sierra for Shutter. That's pretty legit. It's, Probably the only way you win. Huh? This, this is just gonna get siphoned or Shadow Flame. I guess Shadow Flame's pretty cool. Well, right if you had Siphon, you lose with the other play too. Yeah. It, you can like PO and Shadow Flame something. You can you can have a lot of fun this turn as the lock. You have eight cards in hand. You can tap for a ninth. You can do whatever the heck you want, right? I mean, you could you could press twisting the other and win this game, which would be a uh, really bad play, the worst play possible, right? I, I feel like no, because you can suicide the shredder before the twisting, right? No, you can't. Yeah, no, you, 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 oh yeah, you yeah, can. You can. Yeah, you, hit, yeah. you hit. You hit. You hit. You hit. You suicide the shredder and then you twisting the other. Best play. Okay, so he's just gonna shadow flame the shredder. Which is actually a good play, we're trolling. Yes. And then... Can we see the concede? Can we see the next can game? We, can we see the concede? Just waiting for that concede. Uh, that's not good enough. Dog's turret actually looks pretty solid. Like a lot of good cards in there. There's only 8, 10, 12 on board. And there's one off on And board. actually Stripe doesn't have it. He has Dark Peddler. Always draws one damage, watch. Or yeah, usually draws four. Uh, faceless is not lethal. He also draw one. The boar or the elven archer? Oh, oh didn't he draw misses. one damage! He misses! Uh... Nothing that faceless were charged. Faceless owl. Oh boy. That's a big board. Is he going off face? Nice. Okay. Okay. Alright, now he trades the shredder and the doomsayer comes up. And then we have a... Oh. No, it doesn't do anything. Doomsayer comes off, and then... <laughs> well, he made all the attacks, right? So then you attack the Shredder last, Doomsayer pop, reset board. Stripe only has three cards. Okay. Dog top decks, Ancient Allure, BJ, the Doctor Boom. Back it up. Thinking of ways. Uh, it's from... just unfair, like, that's a real deck, the Reno. A real deck that's versus a, not a real deck. That's a tier one deck. Yeah. And Warlock should've been banned. Warlock's OP. Wait. But then Mage would have to be banned, too, because Mage is a real deck, too. And Reno? Reno Mage? What? It's not uh, as real, it's like tier two. Yeah. But it's it's surreal, good. The realist. Uh I mean, some people are playing like rogue with all one ofs. Oh like dog right here. <laughs> yes. Ro rogue with all one ofs, what is that? That's what I do. It's like you can pretty much build like an, an old school like tempo rogue. Yeah. That was like popular two years ago. It's not uh, horrible, it's just not competitive and constructive. I remember that really old school tempo rogue. It had dark just like Dark Iron Dwarf, Ragnaros. Uh, Argent Commander. Argent Commander. Yeah. What were the five drops in that? Oh, Azure Drake. Yeah, yeah Azure Drake. Azure Drake's been in every deck. I think it had Harvest Golems. Oh, Spiteful Smith. Oh, yeah, Spiteful Smith. And it had Harvest Golems, right? Probably, yeah. Everyone played Harvest Golem. No good options on three. Uh, Sabotage is an interesting card. Um, beats Warrior real good. Yeah. No Warriors except for... The guy with two warriors. Is Strife right. keeping his hand? No. No way. It's pretty good against Rogue. You just kill all their minions. That's like, that's what Chalky did against me. I just played stuff and you just killed him. He's yep. like, oh, if you play a 3-3, three, three, I torch it. If you play a 5-4, I probably will pick it. Yeah. Fireball, yeah. that guy. Yeah. And there's the yep. one of scientists. Oh, Ronan. 
Ronin not bottom three. That's actually looking so good. Striker is so ahead of everyone in this competition because he actually kind of just plays these decks by choice. Like like he plays like all the grinder mages and the Reno luck. Yeah, he actually has practice in this event. Yeah, yeah, but he uh, he doesn't know the Jeff Reno stuff. I don't even. Yeah, know. no, I mean, I mean, in this particular the, challenge, in this particular challenge, he. Uh, that's a good spot. That's a pretty solid uh, coin teacher back so. Yeah. Yeah. So what else are you gonna do? Uh, coin villager. Yeah, you think you could dagger pirate it? But you don't really want to give the secret to your and, and so here you, you just don't want to see fireball on your teacher, and then you're in a decent spot. Oh, I think if there's fireball, like you you still have the initiative with the the second four drop coming down turn after. It looks like stretch. Yeah, just, but when they don't have the fireball, it feels good, man. Yeah, when the, the teacher actually gets value. It's awesome. See. Doesn't Flame strikes an eventual good draw. Oh, that's dupe. Uh, I guess you're yellow to sabotage, right? Let's see. It, it, if, if it's counter spell, you're, you feel real stupid, but you still get your token, I believe. It's not gonna be counter spell. He's checking for entity. That's interesting. All right, he's marking. Let's go. That's interesting. I. Is Sabotage really getting better than 6 damage? No. Like, when Sabotage is just Fireball, I feel like it's pretty good. Uh, no matter what, Strife has to ping here, right? There's just so much things that he needs to be pinging right now. Yeah, let's check our... We're either checking our Arcane Electro on Steel Portal first. I think the Portal's better, because then you Cause can... maybe get him in to play this Yeah, time. you can squeeze in a 4-drop with a ping. That'd mm -hmm. be pretty strong. With perfect RNG, you can squeeze in a 4-drop with a ping. Yeah. Play a second Water Elemental play the ping. That's the play. Water elemental ping. Yeah. Very good. Uh, I guess I guess maybe you don't actually have to ping, because like the the big thing is the like the bubble. We can always ping the Scarlet next turn. Ooh. You might source his apprentice mirror image. Uh it's not bad. Yeah, it's actually really good. It's unlikely in this kind of format that you get punished by like spell power fan and knife or a blade flurry turn. Oh, he's just gonna ping. Okay, that's fine. Now, oh no, wait. He still has the dupe up, so there's no way he's playing images, right? They're actually not terrible. I mean, if you live to the long game, it, it, you just. I mean, yeah, he already has like so much value. I think, I think, and they cost zero, so you can play like Paladin Shredder, Image, Image. Yeah, it's pretty good. Sometimes when when you're streaming, people always think it's so bad to dupe the images in this situation. It's not. Yeah, it's, it's, it's fine. Like it depends. Like if it's Control Warrior. You really want like some minions, some real minions, but like yeah, look, control where you want like a Twilight Drake. Yeah, or, like, something but like, like look at looking at Strike's hand, it's it was already stacked. So yeah, maybe you're right. Maybe okay. you're right. I think so. I mean, what you can't actually play these water alleys. Like you're not gonna play both of them. You have you have good things to play every turn. You have a sky golem. I mean, you might play one water alley, but like right here, water alley sources of Prentice mirror, which is good. Yeah, I think, like, I he has gonna, so many minions that it, it takes a long time. You don't you don't want to get like. I think I think water alley sources of Prentice mirror is good here. I feel like the there, there's no way Doc can get around getting flame strike here, right? Nothing he can do. No. Uh, the fans. You can't really push Ooh. that much damage. All right, so he's gonna pipe. Is he gonna fan ice? He would have done a first check draw, right? Uh, logic says yes, but oh, oh okay, no. He's just gonna like double trade. Hmm. You you have to trade or else you just lose the skill strike here, right? But trading is disgusting. Killing water elemental feels bad. Yeah. All right, all in. Oh, I guess by healing the teacher, like the Yelly still has to go in the teacher. Yeah, but and I mean, then you get flame strike here, and he has no minions in hand. Yeah, it's gonna be it, I think. I mean, uh, you can deadly poison the water alley and play. Oh, Ooh, boy. he's a real card. Yeah. Next turn. It's not that far. Oh, you get to cycle the fan. You can stress them out, fan too. Oh my God. Okay, he, he, he can still win. Yeah, with the spare part and like and the coin that's like two cards. Your mana off playing. Maybe you just coin a new rack though, huh? Oh, my. it's so. It's a tough one. There, there's no way Strife's not playing Polymorph, and he's already drawn like a bunch of cards. Double four. Water really seems pretty drawn, solid. Yeah. So he did end up getting to play both one eyes. Oh. I feel like he wants. Oh wow, he's just going for it. 
I don't know, man. I feel like cycling off the gas. No, I mean, because he's not going to have some crazy miracle. He's going to have like one, maybe one sap in his deck. I mean, he, he would have needed to draw sap and an invis there, right? To clear the board. Uh, and a prep. And a prep, yeah. Yeah, well, it wasn't very likely, but it would have been baller. Uh, so it doesn't get polymorph? Do you, I guess you just kind of ignore it, right? Um, you could ignore it. You're at 15. You could actually die if you ignore it. But maybe you torch it and king. And then there's just a 4-4. Or he's gonna do this I like so this. I like this is very aggressive. It's nice. He could just freeze it with his water alley. You just ignore it. Your guy is caught, too. Like, ooh, okay, a Greek. Okay. Oh my god. Oh, it miracle hit. time. Alright, so he has a 50-50 on hitting the sabotage on the... On, on he might want to hit it on the Tazdingo and then draw lethal somehow. Oh yeah, 66. Oh wait, 66 percent that actually killed the um, the Amphinitus if you sabotage. Right yeah, yeah, you can you can just hit the Tazdingo and then kill the Amphinitus. Oh, his Reno. Oh my. Oh my God. Wait, 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 you can actually win this game. You, I, which one do you taunt? I guess you taunt this one health dude. But, yeah, just that's the thing. I don't know. I guess your gadget doesn't die on board like that, because right? if you ping the 8-1, then yeah, there's yeah, only 3 yeah. damage left on board. Yeah. Uh, but you know your opponent has a fireball from the Antonitis. Uh, Missiles is pretty good. Hmm, let's see. Like, you can just go Missiles and maybe trade one of the 4-4s, four and then you play Rotom. As long as you hit one Missile on the gadget, that would be a line. No. Uh, no. well, I mean, you could just fireball the gadget and torch freeze ping, the other guy. Or torch ping the other one. And then you and can play your, your... um. Oh yeah, you can fireball, torch ping, and then play the Volcanic play, play for the zero. Play the Volcanic for zero, yep. That's really good. Uh, so Blade Flurry is probably the best draw for Doug in response. He, he still has the Deadly Poison up on, the, on that dagger, right? Man, the, the deck looked so different. All of a sudden he had got Reno and a new Rack and Gadget. At first it looked like... It looked like, a, had, it looked like a Tempest. Like he had to win right away, yeah. Yeah, he, he curved out pretty good in the early game. Yeah. There we go. Oh, dog. And, and he's uh, kind of dying. That three drink. Zero mana, six four. Seems good. I think it was a four six. It was such a good card. If that was a four six, it'd be busted. Five 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 would be busted. Ooh, sprint. Uh, so you can actually kill the drink pretty yeah. good. I, I just feel like uh, for, well, for yeah. Dog, it's going to be really, really hard to ever actually play uh, a new brand. Yeah. Well, maybe after the Reno turn. Uh, Reno turn and then a new brand. Yeah, if, he, if he's got the board kind of under control. I feel like he's got to like sprint into like a big blade flurry first. This, this, got, this became an interesting game. Now it's anyone's game. Uh, I, feel I, mean, like, I feel like Strife's still like... Strife's ahead. I would rather be Strife, but the Rogue hand. having Reno in hand and then a noob the next turn, it's possible to win. Are you, you're not, in your mind, you're never going for a sprint first? Uh, you already used backstab, you already used one prep. No, you're... But like, oh my, God. like you can sprint sap and be in it, maybe? Looks like a Reno turn to me. Uh, Shiv first, though. Shiv's really good. You can actually clear the water elemental uh, with the 3-3 three, three and the blood mage. Yeah, because it's a damage shift. And then you get the immediate draw as well. Uh... I th it's for sure. You, you, yeah, you're shiving. You're shiving the water, Ellie. Oh, he's shiving face! Oh, he's, oh, he's going, going all in? Wait, what could he have drawn there? Oh, he, if this would have been five, you only have I think damage. I think he's just going to go Reno all face. He's, he's putting, a, he's putting oh, Strike to nine, right? How? What does he have in his deck that's going to kill him, though? Nothing, but he's forcing Strike to trade into him. Given the, the flame strikes already gone, like... Yeah, yeah. You only scared of Ooh, Kieran's... Kieran lets you play the entity, so you can Strife can actually just dump his hand here. Kieran, man of uh, In a way, in a way, the dog has AOE with the, the Skulker, but maybe you check the Conjurer first. Yeah, you Conjurer. You check the Conjurer. Yeah, yeah. Let's see what we get. Nova or something. Like that. For probably. I mean, Nova has a new Brack in hand, so maybe Polly. If you're thinking that way, it, I guess your opponent just went back up to 30 health, so maybe you have to start thinking a bit more long term. Yeah, I, I think agree. Frostbolt's yeah. better immediately, I guess. Frostbolt is better right now. I don't think he's... Oh, yeah, he's gonna Frostbolt. So he doesn't squeeze in the mana room. Uh, yeah, it, his opponent just went back up to 30. And this is... Frostbolt 3-3, you wanna freeze the face with the Water Ellie. And 
Oh, I guess you just ping. Oh. I guess you should have pinged the Bolly more. You should have then. Oh my god, this blade flurry though. This blade flurry. Oh. Man, why doesn't Maybe Dark... you sprint at the blade flurry. He's doing I it. I think so, yeah. I think you have oh, to. Oh, blade flurry's dirty. Nope. 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 Come on, blade flurry. Nope. Oh! Yes! What a draw. Oh, he, he was like, no, no, and then he just slightly nodded when he uh, got it. He was just like... <laughs> and half an ice is already gone, so like... And the... There's still flame I'm waker. I, I, now I'm. There's gotta be flame waker. He's regretting out, right? taking that frostball now. I think. Yeah, for sure. I mean, he, he knows there's that new bracket. Uh, but there's still this question. Suddenly, Strife crows all in, and the rogue has the late game. Oh my god! Is this, this is just lethal. This is just lethal. All right. Oh, oh wait, what secret's up? It's it's entity. Oh. Yep. Yeah, this is just lethal. Uh, all right. Easy so, win. So dog's really good and just stole that game. Is what we just saw. No, we, uh, once once he had the Reno, we thought that he could win. Yeah, for sure. And, like, he, he only has one guard left, and it's so likely he's going to have Blade after this game. But, like, Stripe walked right into it. Did he have a... Uh, Did he have a way not to... Oh, well, he should have used the Frostbolt to kill a 3 feet. And had, had the Water Alley still. He, and hit the Water Alley into the... But then he still would have died the next turn anyway. He should have hit into the Blood Mage. His board wouldn't have been gone. But, yeah, he still would have died. Still would have died the next turn. Then change over. Yeah. You know, the, the, the part that was really good that I, I wouldn't have done was going face instead of trading to the water alley. It's, it's a water alley that's freezing you in your yeah, rope. Yeah, it's yeah, actually yeah. really annoying. And you could kill it with the shiv in the 3-3 three, three, and the 1-1. One, one. Yeah, I would have traded too. That was pro by dog to go face. Full face, man. When you're that low, too. I feel like this is... like yeah. oh, Usually, usually nourish. there aren't many moments where you could say that uh, the player really won the game by some little thing like that. But yeah. it really happened here. Yeah, it really did. I, I wouldn't have gone face. You wouldn't have gone face either. No. And yeah. he finished with exactus. Yep. So I guess he kind of knew exactly what he had left in his deck and his only damage. Like you asked, what were you killing your opponent with? Oh, the one of us, right? The one. Yeah. <laughs> but I, said, I said the one of us, It's not going to kill him quite yet, you know. But then um, he had the blade flurry did the damage yeah. for three damage. That's what he needed. Yeah, exactly. His dagger to attack. Because I was saying his dagger's going to be frozen for the rest of the game, so he's never going to. So he needed three. the blade flurry. Yeah, blade he needed the blade flurry and Ibis, Yeah. Uh. Oh my god, Intervate Nurse. I don't think you ever go for crystals. Like we saw in the against the Reno Lock, he kinda just ran out of guards because Yeah. Yeah. Uh so I guess do you Intervate draw three guards? Well it's fence we draw right now. Yep. yep. Cause now you uh, you have a play for next turn, so. Yeah. Draw three you guards. Want, you want like uh Druid of the Claw or Lothed, something like that. Yeah. Oh, Druid of the Claw. Yeah, that's pretty good. Savage or oh it's combo the sun. He has combo, but What's he's right? he needs something to play on turn six. He'll he'll drive by then probably. Oh, counter spell. He's um, going coin yeti, I think. I, I I don't like uh. I guess like it's pretty hard to make really good decks in this format, but like counter spell and yeti tend not to go in the same deck because you, you give, give them a spare part cost only one minute to get rid of the yeah. counter spell. Yeah. The, so you you they, you don't even force them to use a card kind of thing. Uh, so what's going on here? Uh, with oh, the image is actually pretty sick here, right? And Dog, I think, only saw Mirror Entity and Duplicate, so he has he's, he has no idea that this is a counter spell. Yeah, he might um, charge. The Druid Saber. He might play the one of those small cards. Yeah. Okay. Druid. Well, I, I guess you start with the attack into the zero two with uh, the Shredder. Shredder so duplicate. duplicate. Then you play Druid of the Claw Duplicate, and then you have to deal with like either Mirror Entity or. But you didn't see counter spell last. You're gonna game, see so. it's not Duplicate, and then he. Probably gonna play the small minion. Yeah, he's gonna respect the entity. It's a really poor play. Well, it's probably correct, but it, it's just like so much weaker. Uh, Savage Roar puts it off. I guess he has. He still has like a pretty big board. And not, does bomb lobbers? Like Strife's not paying here. He's gonna play bomb lobber. I guess you could ping portal. Ping portal kill you. I mean, that. I mean, it depends how skilled you are at Portal, whether that's a really good play. Oh, yeah, it also depends on how skilled you are on, on Bomb Lover. Where, where do you even want to hit Bomb Lover? Man, right. you Portal and you get like Water Alley here in one minute and you ping. <laughs> it's always Water Alley. You it's so always the answer. <laughs> it always seems like you want Water Alley, huh? Here we go. What else? What else? A Shredder. A Shredder. Yeah. Water Alley actually looks better right now. Yeah, I think Water Alley is just like kind of like a. Against a lot of classes, it's just a better card than Shredder. It's like against Execute, it's weaker, and against Fireball, it's weaker. Uh, Druid doesn't have that card. Water at least. A bummer for Druid to see. Dang, Portal seems fun. 
Are we having fun? When are you really playing this bomb armor though, I guess? It's on curve. Yeah, there you go. It's the ooze, which is a pretty good result. I guess you go fast with the Eddie, right? I don't much care for that trade. Uh, so, dog trades Shredder for Yeti, I guess, here. Ooh, that's a that's a doozy of a draw. He can get rid of the, the bomb lover with, with his spare part now. Is that the later? Yeah, you don't need to do it immediately. Though. I know. Oh, Trog's pretty good, right? You can... Yeah. Oh, but he doesn't have... He actually might want to get, like, Savage Roar Counterspell next turn, so he can, like, plus one attack the game hunter to Skygold, right? Hmm. He only has four health. That's a good point, but you have combo in hand, you're gonna throw away Savage Roar. Yeah, it's really good. That's too try hard, man. <laughs> <laughs> That's when you're like, okay. <laughs> you you got his guy going here, right? Yeah, actually what you said makes no sense, because you could just use this if you really wanted to use the Savage Roar, it would just buff like the Trog to kill it, you know. Oh, I guess you just play fours and kill him next turn, right? Yep. <laughs> Nice game. Game's easy when you draw Emperor. Uh, smart, smart. Actually, uh, Strife looks like he's in a situation where he's gonna have to trade off this 6 4 no matter what. Yeah. And then Fireball, another guy, and leave up 3 3. Uh, Dupe's like a pretty good. Dupe's pretty good, actually. Especially, like, he's gonna... wow, oh, he's, he's drawing. He's gonna portal. Fireball. What, are, what is he really looking for off the drop? Ooh. Well, you don't really mm -hmm. want to dupe. You never want to play dupe with Kieran because you, then you don't have any secrets and you have two Kieran's. So. Maybe he's looking for Nova or something. But the safer play was probably just Fireball, hit a minion, and, and dupe Portal. I think Portal's the best because you're actually developing a minion. Dupe yeah, too yeah, slow. yeah. Dupe too slow. I agree. Uh, but it, on the same token, like you get double four drop for the next turn. Double at least. <laughs> <laughs> Raven Idol, that's a interesting card. I guess you go for minion here. You just want like an extra minion on the board so that you can set up lethal. Oh wait, wait. Yeah, yeah you Raven Idol take a minion probably and then drew the claw hero power face, put him to fourteen. What? Yeah, that's good. Or you just hero power and play a six six. Baldi is pretty cool here. Oh, you actually took the Iron Bark. It's not. It's not really going to be too relevant. I think the game's going to Yeah. You just you put him. You put him to fourteen. This is how you drew it. Perfect. Perfect. Uh, broke back. Strife's uh, mage actually looked really good. I'm surprised that. Well, let's not call. Yeah, let's see the top deck, but. Yeah. Uh, and the portal. Wait for the portal. Yeah. So Anoyatron. He, he does not even have a way of killing the. Drew the portal. I'm not trying to still save you, right? Uh, you can buff that using with the Mad Scientist. That doesn't matter. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I'm, I'm looking at the bright side of things here, man. Uh, you can arcade boss your Mad Scientist if you have a defensive secret, but maybe uh, it doesn't. Like Vaporize? Bring out your dead. Vaporize isn't Vaporize even doesn't save you, but um, Ice Block does. It's looking like a tempo mage, so why would you have Ice Block, right? And we already saw Entity, Counterspell, and Dupe. There's you're not running four secrets or five, right? Well, if you have cured tour, you can. <sighs> okay. The dog could just do this because he counter spells gone. He has yeah, yeah, get yeah. Get only have one of each. And congrats to dog. That mage actually looks really good. I'm really surprised. Look at dog. That's a happy dog. <laughs> oh, he brought back. <laughs> that was good. That was nice, bro. Bro, I mean. He did that emote really well. That should be a new emote. Some, someone cropped that out. Global emote. Yeah, new global. Dog, dog with his tongue out. Mm. Do your best, Brug Bug. See, that's terrible. I have, no, I have nothing. Mm. I have nothing. And I was on the spot. Maybe he, he actually like practiced in the mirror this morning. No? Yeah, maybe. I didn't do that. He doesn't seem like that kind of guy, though. He seems like he just goes with the flow. He's naturally good at just making touch emotes yeah. in real life. Spontaneous. I'm jealous. Who uh, who's playing next? I have no idea. Uh, so I play orange play. Uh, where was that? Who played already? Admirable played against. Trump didn't play, right? Trump has not played. So they played. Trump and orange. Yeah, orange hasn't played. So the next Trump match should be Trump against orange. With <laughs> no warrior. 
<laughs> You've only won this fight between both decks. Yeah. I feel like Trump, like, oh. you're, you're always going to end up banning uh, the Druid and let him have the double PJs lawyer. are coming in. The what? The PJs. The PJ, though. I hear the DJ. I'm like, I'm not. No, yeah, no strike. What happened, man? Tell, Do you want to tell the story? Yeah. We can use this, like, next, what like, story? next casting game. Like, when you're casting, mm -hmm. we can tell the story. What story? Uh, whatever happened yesterday or no. didn't happen. Oh, you have a great story. That's right. No. no. Yeah, I, I said you might not want to tell a story. I'm yeah, was, tell a story. yeah I was, I was so defending your privacy. But you're so happy. I'm a defender just, of privacy. Just say some happy stuff. Well, come on, dude. You're not fucking... Look happy at stuff coming up next? Like, awesome. like dinner, for example. Oh, that was happy. Mm -hmm. okay. You can just That's talk nice, about the uh, dinner. You can talk about, nice like... Mongolian beef and... Yeah. White rice. See you guys after the break!